Yes, prom! Yes! <laughs> 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 A few moments later channel so today's makeup transformation is my prom edition and today I have my good friend with me Viva Glam K. Hi! Hi. Um, her <laughs> name is Kaylani and she's the one if you guys didn't watch my Cinderella, Cinderella um, story this was the girl that I took my class with the beauty bakery where we don't eat to live. We beat to live. Yes we have like a makeup class that we started last year we took it to New York and it was amazing check out the Cinderella story anyways this is the prom makeup tutorial I decided to go for some purples and bright colors because prom like turn up have fun like play with color it's like your one night to be like Cinderella so turn up and like show them what you got with your makeup. So okay. I will have two, probably two or three different prom tutorials. This tutorial in particular, this. Yes, <laughs> this, no, I like it. Look, the hair coming out of place and this, everything. This tutorial um, <laughs> will be more so for you makeup artists that are aspiring. So it will show you tips and tricks on how to apply it to a client or um, a model that you want to practice on. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoy this tutorial. By the way, we will be at IMAT's New York City! Yay! This will be our one chicken for girl. Yeah, because that's how excited I am. Yes, we are. <laughs> Me too, but mine will take. Uh, anyways, um, we're so excited. And um, this will be our one year anniversary. We went to IMAT's last year. It was amazing. And it'll be a year for the both of us. We're so excited. We hope to see you guys there. We'll be there on Saturday. And, and on Sunday, Sunday, booth 632 at Jibia's Place. And all the products I want to say will be linked in the description box below. Everything that I used on Kehlani. So, um, she looks so sickening, right? I love it. You guys do not have to splurge and buy a lot of makeup. Use what you have at home. Use what's at your Walgreens. Use what's at your mall. Um, and I hope you guys learned something today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I love you. And... Enjoy. Turn up! Hey guys, so the first thing that I'm going to take is this Fix Plus Spray. Her skin is very, very dry. I'm going to spritz this all over her face. And then next, since she's dry, I'm going to take this Nourishing Skin Enhancer by Makeup Forever and rub this in all over the face. I really want to prep her skin properly so none of the foundation flakes off or slides. Um, and I think prep is super, super, super important when it comes to foundation and an important day like prom. Next, I'm going to take the Makeup Forever HD Foundation and I'm going to squirt this on the back of my hand. And I'm going to apply this onto the wider parts of her face. Not wider, but like the larger surfaces like the cheeks and the forehead. And as you guys can see, I'm only going to apply this... Um, layer by layer and then let that side dry and then go back to that side again and then apply another layer but most importantly I'm not applying a lot of product onto the under eye area because I don't want that to cake up so I'm gonna le leave the under eye area alone um, as a makeup artist I just want to let you guys know um, when you're doing makeup on somebody it's super important to have fun as you guys can see we're laughing and having fun talking about boys and it's an experience because makeup is also a luxury but most importantly an experience for your client um, moving on the concealer that I'm using is Tarte um, Maracuja concealer with the Morphe um, Kabuki brush for the under eye this is an amazing brush and this concealer is very very full coverage but um, I like to blend it out with my booty blender yes my booty blender 
um this is the white one it reminds me of the easter egg and i'm going to buff this onto the face and what's amazing about using a sponge and a heavy concealer is that a sponge picks up what is excess on the face and also leaves what is needed on the face that's why i like using the booty blender um next i'm going to take my laura mercier translucent powder and this brand new tapered brush by morphe and it's super tapered and i'm only going to powder the under eye area because i'm going to use a liquid to contour and bronze the face but to set the under eye and make it super durable i'm going to set it with the brush this is an amazing palette the concealer palette by morphe check it out 10 percent off check out the info below um, moving on next i'm going to take the studio fix fluid foundation and this is like the perfect color and i'm going to buff this onto the forehead area and the outer perimeter of the face and as you guys can see it's going on super smooth because i did not put any powder if i were to put powder the powder and the liquid would mix and it would turn into something called like a cake batter which is not what we want for this look um i'm going to prime her eyes using that same um tart concealer and i'm going to prep the eyes using cupcake and peach smoothie by makeup geek these eyeshadows are super blendable and i love using them together and i'm going to use this as a transition color for the rest of our um, the eyeshadows that we're going to use um, The first eyeshadow that I'm going to use is in this morphe palette. It is super inexpensive and Since we are using bright colors, you want to make sure you blend 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 and I'm using the blending brush by Sigma the e40 You guys should definitely have this if you don't then you should definitely buy it um, It's a must-have in a kit in your personal life and professional life um, and I'm taking these purples and I'm working my way down and I'm taking the Sigma E25 brush and I'm taking the super pigmented purple and I'm going to buff this on the outer part of the eye. And we want to make sure that you're adding a little bit at a time. It's easier to add than take away. So take your time buffing. So as you guys can see, we started with the lighter colors and made our way to the darker colors. And then I'm going to continue to buff with the E40 brush. Next, I'm going to take this um, flat brush by Sigma and I'm going to take this foiled Make It Be Shadow. I forgot the name, but it's beautiful. It's super beautiful. These are my high school colors. I don't know if, if that's why I picked these colors, but I love purple. Purple looks beautiful on everybody, everybody. Um, but you're not limited to use purple if, you, if you're not wearing a purple dress, but purple is a beautiful color for any occasion. And um, quick fact, um, her eyeliner is so fleek and so fierce. I was so scared to do her eyeliner. This, this was my first time ever doing Kehlani's liner, but she liked it. Um, moving on to the lashes, I'm taking Blinking Beaut lashes, the Samantha ones. They're beautiful, they're dramatic, they're super, super glamorous, and they're beautiful for prom, a wedding, a night out, and I do have a link below for 10% off these lashes. Um, these lashes are gorgeous, and I thought they would suit this look super beautifully. And... What I'm going to do is I'm going to line her um, lower lash line and her upper lash line. And I want to make sure that the drama on the bottom of the eye matches the top. So before I do that, I'm going to um, pinch the lashes together with my favorite um, lash curler, Lash Crimper by Sephora. It's The link is in the description box below. We're going to dust off the excess powder. And we're going to um, complete the lower lash line and matching it with the upper lash line. Because the, the, the top of the eye is so dramatic. It has a lash, a liner, it has lots of colors, and it's very top heavy. So you want to make sure that you balance out the lower lash line. Don't be afraid to do this because it really opens up your eye if you smoke it out. Next, I'm going to take the L'Oreal Carbon Black Waterproof Mascara and match the drama on the top. And we're going to take this white shadow and pop it on the inner corner of the eye 
to open up the eye and it just ties the whole look together. Now that the eye is done, I'm going to highlight the face using the Becca Opal highlighter with my fan brush by Sephora and then my Pro Sculpting Duo, the gold one, the second one, number two. And add that on the face for this glowy, juicy look for prom. Um, next, we're going to snatch her nose and we're going to bronze her face using this powder by MAC. And this will just add that extra glow and contour. And then um, we're going to add Milkshake by Anastasia Liquid Lipstick. And we're going to add Gerard Cos Cosmetics Shimmer of Hope. And we're going to add this onto the lips and take this amazing. This These blushes are super pigmented. They're by Morphe. Um, I love them. Someone texted me. Um, and then we're going to do the brows. I do like to do, to do things a little bit out of order. But this, um, for her look, I always like doing her brows last. So I don't go too, too, too strong. But this is the finished look, you guys. You're not limited to use this for prom, for anything. But this is super beautiful. It's super gorgeous. You can use this for a party, a wedding, um, any occasion. And I hope you guys enjoy this look. Please don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe. If you guys recreate this, tag me on social media. I love you. And remember that life opens up when you do. And I hope you guys enjoy this look. Bye.